Hi, I'm Alexia and you're watching the Welcome Channel. Welcome to our beautiful city of Miami. Palmeras Beach Club welcomes you to a new unique experience. This lush oasis is located on its own private island in Coconut Grove. Relax and cool off at Parrot Cove, a beautiful private beach, only a jungle island. Come for an interactive, fun day with the sea creatures at Miami's favorite attraction, Miami Seaquarium. Just 50 miles from Port Miami, embark on the ultimate Caribbean getaway to Resorts World Bimini. Want to try your luck at thoroughbred racing in the casino? Or have fun while shopping and dining in one of Miami's premier entertainment destinations? Then it's time to experience Gulfstream Park. The Welcome Channel presents Miami and the Beach's condominium previews and developer profiles. Coming up, one of Crandon's golf pros talks about some essential tips for golfing during your visit to Miami and the beaches. I'd like to give you some tips uh, regarding golf and when to play and how to play it. Sea Spice Seafood Brasserie and Lounge, located on the banks of the Miami River, exemplifies the essence of waterfront dining. Hello and welcome to Miami Beach. My name is Dirk, I'm your local lifeguard with Miami Beach Ocean Rescue and I would like to give you some safety tips before you head out to the beach. First things first, before you leave your hotel room you should apply some sunscreen generously and you should take a lot of water with you because the heat and the sun is underestimated on our beaches. Besides the fact that we only get big waves a few times a year, the ocean here is widely underestimated. We do get very strong currents on, on particular conditions, on onshore winds. So it's imperative that when you come to the beach, you observe the flags on the lifeguard towers. Those flags will signal you what the conditions are and how safe it is to go swimming, and if there's anything in the water that you should worry about. The Miami Beach Ocean Rescue flag system works somewhat like traffic lights. Red flag is for Extreme caution, strong currents, only if you're a strong swimmer should you go in the water. Yellow flags are for moderate currents, it's okay to go swimming, just stay near a lifeguard tower and make sure you don't get into a deep spot if you don't know how to swim. And then we have the green flag, the green flag is all go, happy, flat day, enjoy yourself and have fun. If you're visiting our beautiful beaches to do some water activities like water sports like stand up paddle boarding or surfing or kite surfing or windsurfing, there's opportunity to do that, but you have to follow some rules and also you have to go to some particular locations. Those water sports are only allowed 4th Street South, particularly surfing, stand up paddle boarding. Kite surfing is really only allowed after hours or at an unguarded area between 22nd and 29th Street on South Beach. There you will see kite surfers helping each other and watching out for each other. It's a, it's a large community and they take care of each other. One more thing I would like to ask of you is please respect our beaches, please don't leave garbage, please use garbage cans, please don't let garbage get in the water, don't get drunk and get into the water with containers and stuff like that, that's not allowed, we take that very serious. Please respect our beaches, then we're very happy to have you here. Welcome to Miami Beach and enjoy and have a safe vacation. Being Italian, there's a few words I like to use, and one is punto, or point. And the point is, there's no better place to get Italian food than at Puntino. All of their dishes are prepared by their renowned culinary maestro, Chef Fabio Vaccarella, from the freshest seafood and homemade pastas, or farm fresh meats. If you're still hungry after that for some more mouth-watering food, then take a walk next door to their pizzeria. Puntino's pizza is the real deal. Get to the point and have a taste of Puntino's.
Explore Miami with Bike and Roll on a Segway or bike. It's the fun way to discover Miami. Join Bike and Roll on one of their entertaining Segway tours or rent a Segway and glide around with a friend. Segways are a fantastic way to tour. It's the way to roll. The Art Deco Segway Tour departs daily from two convenient South Beach locations. To reserve a spot, visit BikeMiami.com or call 305-604-0001. In addition to Segways, Bike and Roll also offers a large selection of guided bike tours and rides. Miami is a fantastic place for biking. Ride along the beach path and across the Venetian Islands to Bayside. Or continue to Little Havana, Vizcaya, and Coconut Grove. For the more adventurous, join Bike and Roll for a guided tour to Key Biscayne or for the Bike and Kayak Tour. Bike and Roll carries a wide variety of rental bikes for all ages and sizes. The bikes are perfect for longer rides and more affordable than the city vending bikes for extended rentals beyond one hour. For a complete list of bike and Segway rides and tours, visit BikeMiami.com or ask your concierge for a free Bike and Roll map and brochure. Bike and Roll has three locations, by 10th Street and Collins Avenue, at Lincoln Road and James Avenue, and at Bayside Marketplace. To book your fun, call Bike and Roll at 305-604-0001 or visit them online at BikeMiami.com. If you're traveling to South Beach, you haven't really experienced it until you've experienced Lincoln Road. Go for the shopping, the food, or just the people watching. Lincoln Road Mall is an eight-block long pedestrian walkway between Washington Avenue and Alton Road, filled with shops, restaurants, cafes, all in the Art Deco and Mediterranean styles found throughout South Beach. Carl Fisher, the builder and developer of Miami Beach, envisioned Lincoln Road as a future Rue de la Paix. In the 1930s, Miami Beach's publicists began marketing Lincoln Road as the Fifth Avenue of the South. Originally, Lincoln Road was covered by a forest of mangroves, as was much of Miami Beach. In 1912, Carl Fisher began hand-clearing Lincoln Road, and it eventually became the town's social center. In the late 1950s, the city of Miami Beach asked architect Morris Lapidus, architect of the Fountain Blue and Eden Rock Hotels, to convert Lincoln Road into a pedestrian walkway, and hence, Lincoln Road Mall was born. Today, Lincoln Road is a place like no other. On any given day, Lincoln Road is South Florida's favorite place for people watching and is world famous with sidewalk acts, celebrity sightings, models strutting through with fashions leaving little to the imagination, and every language spoken worldwide fills the air. Lincoln Road continues to be among one of the most popular destinations for our visitors to Miami and the beaches, home to the New World Symphony Orchestra, a state-of-the-art movie theater, and the Colony Theater. Lincoln Road is an arts and entertainment and American cultural epicenter. Visiting the New World Symphony is a must. Frank Gehry's fabulous design of the building both inside and out, to the many free or very inexpensive concerts, to Pulse, their version of a nightclub. So welcome to the New World Symphony. I'm Craig Hall, and we're here this evening at a Wallcast concert. And a Wallcast is something that's special to the New World Symphony and here in Miami Beach. Uh, and as you may be able to see behind me, what we do is we project concerts uh, onto the front of the wall uh, with great speaker system outdoors uh, for the people to enjoy for free. So 1,500 people, 2,000 people out here enjoying classical music, uh, concerts happening live inside, you get to witness it outside under the stars here in Miami Beach, so it's really fantastic. When you're visiting Miami and the beaches, Lincoln Road is clearly one destination you definitely don't want to miss. Hope to see you there. Relax aboard the Miami Beach Airport Flyer, an inexpensive express bus from Miami International Airport Metro Rail Station to Miami Beach, seven days a week. Buses are equipped with luggage racks and comfortable seating with plenty of legroom so you can ride in style. Once in Miami Beach, you can transfer to any of the local bus routes. Download our app, MDT Tracker, to plan your fun in the sun outing.
Downtown Miami is a great place to live, in my opinion, because there's so many young people, there's so much culture, there's so many restaurants and food and bars and just different opportunity to do different things. My commute is so easy. I leave my apartment, walk downstairs, walk across the bridge to my office building, get up to the office, and the longest part of my commute is the elevator ride. The view, the vision, the sea, the sky, the people. This is a place that is vibrant every single day. We're the centerpiece of what I believe is a new wave of young folks choosing to live in the urban core. The downtown art scene in Miami is, is evolving in this period of time with three magnificent organizations building beautiful new facilities. We have just opened the Perez Art Museum. Soon to open is the Frost Science Museum and of course the Adrian R Center. In the proximity of each other, a couple of hundred yards apart, one can only see the future of these three facilities as this location becomes more and more a destination. You know what I love most about downtown Miami? The space between the buildings and the people walking in between. Miami was typically thought of as a private banking type of financial market. Today, we have hedge funds, we have private equity firms, we have family offices. We have a whole variety of different alternative investment firms. We have crowdfunding, we have venture capital emerging. We have all the ecosystem of professional advisory firms that support all those financial firms. The list goes on and on and on. So I decided to uh, move to downtown, uh, coming from the beach where I used to work. Uh, because I think there's a fantastic uh, uh, rejuvenation of this part of the city. Downtown Miami for me represents the future of Miami. I see a lot of developments going on and I think it's great for the city. I think there was a few hotels that were here originally and suddenly there's this huge movement of uh, lots of people and lots of fresh new hotels, fresh view of hospitality uh, coming down, downtown and I think it's fantastic for everyone. Downtown is truly the heart of Miami and the pulse of everything comes from, from this, this neighborhood. We have, what, close to 200,000 professionals commute in and out of our downtown every day during the weekday. Our store used to close at six o'clock every day. And for the last two to three years, we've extended our hours to eight o'clock at night. You now have an active nightlife, restaurants, and people staying later in the downtown safely and securely. I think the nightlife scene is going through a big transformation here in downtown. I see a lot of people my age moving to downtown because we have all of the bars and new restaurants. It's becoming the new hit spot, in my opinion. You have places like Mary Brickle Village, which houses a bunch of different restaurants and bars. It's becoming more of an after-hour spot. It's actually a 24-hour destination. If you're a local, I mean, you, you want to live here. Welcome to our program, Venture Hive. We have a 30,000 square foot space right in the heart of downtown. We have 31 companies here from 23 different countries who have decided to move here to make their businesses here. If you're an entrepreneur and you have a big idea, you don't have to go to California or New York or Boston or Austin to do it. We are creating that ecosystem and all of that support so that anyone, anywhere in the world can find a home, not just for their idea, but for their family in downtown. As a venture capital firm in downtown Miami, we're a little different from our peers because we actually invest in people and ideas. And what that means to us is we actually bring our folks into Miami. And so you have to be located in a wonderful place. The beautiful thing about being in Miami is it's a beautiful lifestyle where you can live, work, and play. And we have folks that come to work with us from all different parts of the world and everybody wants to come to Miami. Well, downtown Miami's growing art scene is pretty exciting, obviously with the uh, opening of the PAM. It's sort of become the anchor for the developing arts community in downtown, and uh, it's a really fantastic uh, uh, museum and building, and we're really happy to kind of be in close proximity to what's going on there. From someone that has lived here for a long time, I kind of rediscovered downtown, and, and I was really surprised at like, the things that were happening. One of the things that I really love about downtown Miami is the mover. You have this sort of free uh, transit system that connects all of the venues in downtown together. So it's almost like this perfect place where you can come and like take in not just one space, but hop on a mover and, and go around and, you know, be taken to other things. 
Downtown Miami has a good transportation system already with the Metro Rail and Metro Mover systems. What we're doing with All Aboard Florida is creating a transit hub that will allow the cities of Orlando, West Palm Beach, and Fort Lauderdale to connect. All Aboard Florida is the country's only privately funded uh, railroad infrastructure project. We are creating a connection between Miami and Orlando where 50 million people a year are already traveling uh, that will allow them to get there in three hours. I would say the biggest misconception people have in downtown Miami that there's no life after six o'clock. Uh, I think that's changed drastically. I think the Miamian is, is not only looking to connect uh, socially at, at the nightlife scene, but they're also looking to connect on the fitness scene and we're seeing it just grow leaps and bounds. You're seeing, you're seeing the run clubs pop up, you're seeing people training for the Miami Marathon, you're seeing people at CrossFit, uh, all, the, all the gyms in the area. What I love most about downtown Miami, it's the mix of people that we have, the different languages you hear out there, just the warmth I think we're feeling for, for downtown Miami. People are actually proud to say they're from Miami, that they live downtown. You didn't have that five, six years ago. My name is Leslie Pollock. John Richard. Julie Neitzel. Laurent Fatichini. Randy Alonso. Susan Abbott. Greg Daniel. Scott Sanders. Lady Rodriguez Casanova. Frankie Ruiz. And I work. And I live. And I invest. And I run. In downtown Miami. Please visit us at Perez Art Museum Miami, designed by Pritzker Prize-winning architects Herzog and DeMorion. Wander the galleries and enjoy modern and contemporary works by international artists. Take a seat on the museum's waterfront terrace to enjoy the spectacular view of Biscayne Bay and the elaborate hanging gardens. Visit the Pam Shop to peruse unique gifts, art books, and furnishings. And enjoy delectable dining at Verde's waterfront restaurant and bar. For more information, please visit www.pam.org. In addition to our exhibits, PAM hosts a variety of monthly events. For additional information, please log on to PAM.org. Wolfgang's Steakhouse welcomes you to Miami. After four decades of experience as head waiter at Peter Luger's Steakhouse, it is fair to say that Wolfgang's wiener learned his craft well. Oh, I'm happy to be here in Miami to bring you the best steaks that money can buy. It is dry, aged, prime beef, very juicy and delicious, and I'm very proud of it. The ambiance is straight up classic steakhouse with shiny hardwood floors, a fully stocked mahogany bar, a high-end wine cellar, crisp white table linens, and no nonsense service. Get a seat near the front and your view of the Miami River will entertain all night. Tuck yourself away in the back of the house for a lower profile experience or reserve one of the three private rooms for your special gathering. In addition to steak, one can choose from a simple but scrumptious array of seafood, including jumbo lobster, grilled yellowfin tuna, wild salmon, or Chilean sea bass. For a starter course, may we suggest the out-of-this-world crab cake, little neck clams on the half shell, oysters, lobster cocktail, and jumbo shrimp cocktail. If one wants to indulge in dessert, one can choose from a decadent Junior's New York-style cheesecake, apple strudel, homemade key lime pie, as well as the ice cream sundae, which is a throwback to old ice cream parlor offerings served in a soda shop style glass. Ultimately, Wolfgang Steakhouse is a classic, high quality American steakhouse. Located in downtown Miami at 315 South Biscayne Boulevard or call 305-487-7130. I look forward to see you in the restaurant and to enjoy your juicy best steak you will ever have in your life. Visiting Resorts World Bimini is now more exciting than ever. Experience the exclusive adventure of a seaplane 
flying directly from Miami or Fort Lauderdale. Visit rwbimini.com to book your seaplane to Resorts World Bimini today. Recent years, Miami has erupted onto the car racing scene, and Auto Craze is the one stop shop for all your motorcycle and auto racing needs. Auto Craze carries parts and accessories from brand names like Arai Helmets, Momo, Alpine Stars, and Sparco. With personalized service and an experienced staff, Auto Craze will be able to help you find any part you need. They can also help you look for parts of a pro racing machine. Auto Craze carries car and motorcycle apparel for every budget, so make sure you check out their authentic racing gear. Auto Craze is open from 9.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Friday and from 10 till 2 on Saturday. The store's closed on Sundays. All major credit cards are accepted. Hi, I'm Patricia, Miami native and local blogger behind Miami Nice, where I took a look at authentic Miami lifestyle. Stay tuned as we show you around Coconut Grove, what makes this historic neighborhood different from any other in Miami. The Grove, as we locals like to call it, is a tropical neighborhood with a laid-back feel. It's home to historic landmarks like the 1920s architecture of Vizcaya Museum and Gardens, the Kampong, an 11-acre botanical garden, and finally, the Barnacle State Park, a place to connect with nature or catch an outdoor movie screening. All three attractions have great views because they're located right on Biscayne Bay. But it's not just history buffs who should visit Coconut Grove. I come here to eat at one of the many restaurants, especially because so many have outdoor seating. People come here to hang out and be part of a true Miami locals neighborhood. It still has that certain Miami glamour. It's charming, it's historic, it's Bohemia on the Bay. You can enjoy Coconut Grove's waterfront by attending free yoga classes at Peacock Park, paddleboarding along the mangroves, or heading over to Dinner Key Marina where you can take off for a day on the water. The Grove also has free historic walking and biking tours for everyone to enjoy. Welcome to Miami's oldest seaside neighborhood, founded in 1873. More than 140 years later, this bohemian village offers the ideal setting for strolling, shopping, and dining. The Grove has something for everyone. Top schools, historical landmarks, water sports, markets, festivals, and more. Virtually everything here exists beneath one lush canopy along the turquoise waters of Biscayne Bay. Located in the heart of Miami, the Grove offers an array of boutiques, sidewalk cafes, and gourmet restaurants, all in a pedestrian-friendly zone that can be enjoyed year-round. Now you see why they call it Bohemia on the Bay. La Gamba is a family-owned Spanish restaurant. We specialize in Spanish cuisine with a focus on fresh seafood. We fly all our seafood in from the best providers in the Mediterranean. We do this twice a week. We've uh, really become a reference point for uh, Spanish cuisine in the city of Miami and uh, a meeting point for foodies and experienced gourmets alike. For more than 25 years, H&H &H Jewels presents to you the most exquisite handcrafted jewelry. H&H &H offers unique designs expertly crafted by our own in-house designer, H. Bredemeyer, utilizing GIA certified diamonds and the highest quality gems. Some of our services include estate buying and gold buying, expert jewelry and watch repair, jewelry appraisals, custom engraving, and custom jewelry design. We look forward to your visit. Here at Jaguar, we are a Latin American restaurant. We specialize in ceviches, but we have dishes from all Latin America. We have dishes from Colombia, we have dishes from Argentina, Peru, Ecuador, all over the place. This is what makes Jaguar the most exciting place because you have flavor from all over Latin America, and we also use the ingredients that they use in those countries. So that's, I think, what makes our dishes so special. Two icons in the Grove are Green Street Cafe and Lulu. Both are considered to be the see and be seen restaurants at the corner of Commodore and Main Highway. It is rare not to encounter celebrities or simply dozens of locals enjoying life at Green Street. Brunch here is a must. Across the street is Lulu, a funky sidewalk cafe specializing in fresh, organic ingredients. Both restaurants feature international menus and a lively ambiance. Part shop, part gallery, part jewelry studio, Peruvian jewelry designer Cecilia Gonzalez's space is a must for visitors and locals alike. All jewelry is designed and handmade on the premises. Customized pieces and standout keepsakes can be made while you visit the shop. Whether you're shopping for yourself, in need of a gift, or looking for that special trip souvenir, this one-of-a-kind space is a required stop before going back home. Introducing Pineda Covalin, where fashion comes together with original designs in our store here in Coconut Grove. Our designs express identity and belonging. 
Each design narrates a history, as well as an homage to the anonymous creators of past and present times who have captured the cosmogony of those cultures. Come visit Pineda Covali in Miami. Come experience the difference at Detlev Avida. From the moment you walk in, you're given a warm welcome with a cup of Avida comforting tea. You're treated to a complimentary Avida sensory ritual. Avida's service reputation is built on the philosophy that learning never ends. Our stylists learn to execute their own vision in a way that best suits your wants and needs. The iconic Coco Walk is located in the heart of Coconut Grove, Miami's ultimate destination for dining and entertainment. Coco Walk's unique grounds and buildings were carefully designed to blend seamlessly into the lush surroundings of Coconut Grove. Coco Walk is lined with high-end retail, fine dining, bistro cafes, and live entertainment ranging from jazz to Latin fusion. Coco Walk also offers a 15-screen luxury movie theater, which serves a variety of international wine and beer, as well as small plates. Come visit Coco Walk to shop, dine, and unwind. So much to see, so much to do, and so many experiences to be had. Coconut Grove may be a historic neighborhood, but there's always something new. I know I never get tired of it. Enjoy your stay in Miami, and see you soon. Bye. For more information about what you can experience in Coconut Grove, visit www.coconutgrove.com. The finest ingredients are right in the mix. Welcome to Palmeiras Beach Club. Beyond the shores of Coconut Grove and hidden among lush gardens, Palmeiras Beach Club at Grove Isle is your private island located only 10 minutes from downtown Miami. This oasis is the perfect escape, offering an exclusive and luxury experience. Indulge in the spa center after a set of the tennis court. Let the evenings begin with a glass of champagne at the Bayfront Tattinger Lounge and Beach Club in front of mellow waves and purple skies. Playing on the classic ambience of Ibiza, Spain, Saint-Tropez in southern France, and Mykonos in Greece, Palmeiras Beach Club brings a truly unique experience to Miami. This new relaxing hotspot, located on its own island, is the perfect venue for casual mingles, romantic dinners, and private parties. The patio deck goes in blue and white, and the dining room is decorated to resemble ocean waters with hand-painted walls of local artists. The Perrier Jouet private dining for groups up to 20 people caters a Belle Epoque theme. Palmeiras Beach Club hosts waterfront weddings and private events customized to the guests' unique needs. Yachts can easily dock on the island. Palmeiras Beach Club is located at 4 Grove Isle Drive in Coconut Grove, Florida. For additional information, please call 305-858-8300 or visit www.palmerasbeachclub.com. The Welcome Channel presents Miami and the Beaches condominium previews and developer profiles. Carolina Diago, your host for this very special look at Miami and the beach's hottest real estate areas, including opinions from some of Miami's most known developers and real estate professionals. Miami and the beaches is hot, but not just in the summer. The heat is year round, and that is why buyers are coming from everywhere. Just over 60% of real estate purchases last year were from international buyers. Nine of every 10 purchases of recent built condos in the downtown Miami area were also from international buyers. It's no secret that Miami is a hotbed of international tourism. I mean, why not? Look around me. This place is so beautiful. Now, more than ever, however, what used to be a place for vacation to some is now the playground of the whole world, and everyone wants a piece of it. The beauty about Miami is one can literally go from a mini Manhattan urban landscape to our beautiful pristine beaches within minutes. And if we drive a little to the north, about a 25 minute car drive, we find ourselves in what is being considered as the French Riviera of the South, Sunny Isle Beach. 
Today I get to show you one of Sunny Isles Beach's most magnificent new luxury residential developments, Turnberry Ocean Club. It was envisioned and developed by the renowned developer Turnberry Associates, who was also responsible for the birth of the city of Aventura, Aventura Mall, and the historic Fontainebleau Hotel, among others. Stay tuned as we tour their sales gallery and hear about this amazing new development. Turnberry Associates introduces its newest oceanfront residence, located in Sunny Isles Beach, Florida, Turnberry Ocean Club. So Turnberry Associates uh, was formed back in the 1960s by Donald Sofer and found a big piece of land, vacant land, which was mostly swamp land, uh, which is now known as Aventura. And uh, ironically, he kind of sketched on the back of a cocktail napkin the idea for a whole city in this swampland, which consisted of, uh, you know, hotels, golf courses, country clubs, shopping mall, condominiums, office buildings, strip centers, you name it. Kind of a whole master plan mixed use community, which is now called Aventura. And Turnberry set out about to acquire all that land in the 60s and develop it over the last 50 years. And I think that means a lot to people coming in to buy and invest. You know, you're putting up deposits in these properties, on the residential properties that are to be delivered in two, three, four, five years sometimes. And having a known commodity like Turnberry gives them the confidence that it's going to get built, it's going to get built well with, you know, high quality, with high quality amenities. And that in turn leads to a very good resale down the road whenever they want to go decide to sell it a luxury glass tower that combines both spacious yet efficient floor plans with innovative design, offering a lifestyle and a level of service that is unrivaled in Miami. Visiting the Turnberry Ocean Club Sales Center, located at 215 185th Street in Sunny Isles Beach, provides a first look at this alluring property. This groundbreaking design is both modern and timeless, intelligent, yet simple. It inspires a sense of openness that comes from what you feel, not just from what you see. Jetting 54 stories into the heavens along prime beachfront in sunny isles, the Carlos Zapata Robert Suedro designed high-rise masterpiece embodies the energy, architecture, and opulence of Miami's current IT status a luxury skyscraper as impressive as its Collins Avenue address, the eye-catching Turnberry Ocean Club embraces the apex of Miami's modernity movement, an amalgamation of glass, steel, and towering white pillars, intersected by sleek, protruding balconies on all sides, with a maximum of four residences per floor, to a total of 154 residences as well as a duo of cantilevered 30th floor swimming pools and an alfresco fitness center overlooking the ocean. An added benefit to owning at the Turnberry Ocean Club is that residents will have access to the Turnberry Isle Resort and Golf Club located less than a mile away. The special part is that our buyers can start enjoying this membership from the moment they sign their contract. They don't have to wait to close. And all the amenities and the lifestyle that Turnberry offers Plus, they can also enjoy two championship golf courses over at the Turnbell Resort and Club, in addition to two wonderful restaurants, Bourbon Steak and Corsair. The developer will be paying their initiation fee and first year's dues at this prestigious country club. Membership provides exclusive access to experience two Raymond Floyd redesigned championship golf courses, the Elite Kanyas Tennis Club, three pools, including a lagoon-style pool with a water slide and lazy river, three-story spa and fitness center, private beach club, and remarkable dining options. We look forward to you visiting our sales gallery at Turnberry Ocean Club. For more information on Turnberry Ocean Club, please call 1-88-710-0576 or visit www.turnberryoceanclub.com. Tell me about your buyers. Where are they visiting you from? Our buyers are from all over the world. Uh, just like Miami has become very cosmopolitan, so is Turnberry Ocean Club. We have buyers flying in from all over the world looking for a little piece of that Turnberry lifestyle. 
I can certainly picture myself living here, watching my kids play and enjoying the country club life on the ocean. Can you? Call to book your VIP presentation. We have one of the few remaining sites in Sunny Isles with over 300 linear feet of waterfront. The views are magnificent, the art is fantastic, the architecture is incredible, and the reputation is unsurpassable. All the souvenirs in my memory got me going down in strife. The spotlight of what makes this building that much special is, uh, is our association with Armani Casa and having them design the common areas and, and the units and everything else like that. And so uh, we really created a sales office here that gives you the idea and the feeling and of what is going to be inside the lobbies and common areas. Of the Hope all of you, all the people that have worked with us, all the people that are going to be living here, all the people that get to see it, enjoy it uh, as much as I do. It's really been a work of love, uh, which we're very proud of.
Well, it's a wrap. Next step is to make this pristine setting part of your life. I'm Carolina Diago signing off from Paradise. See you next time. Patton, welcome to my beautiful city, Miami, and you are watching the Welcome Channel. Welcome to Sea Spy Seafood Brasserie and Lounge, located on the banks of the Miami River, exemplifies the essence of waterfront dining. Enveloping an outdoor lounge with a spectacular indoor dining room, both engage stunning views of Miami's downtown skyline. Nestled within a post-industrial warehouse, outfitted in unexpected and sophisticated nautical touches, and featuring over 500 feet of docking facilities. Dining accommodations include the main dining room and bar, an exterior courtyard lounge, and the new introduction to Sea Spice Modern Garden. Sea Spice introduces the area to some serious culinary swagger, personified by a sleek restaurant that focuses on restyled gastro classics and modern cocktailing. Globally inspired seafood menu featuring a raw bar and dishes ranging from wood-fired casseroles to Dover sole, and some say the best ribeye in town, served on an 850 degree volcanic hot stone seared to perfection. The intriguing menu it exhibits the freshest products from around the world, prepared in a modern, visually stimulating style. Modern Garden offers a more intimate space. The name refers to its artistic appearance adorned with an extraordinary permanent art installation, both visually engaging as well as space-defining. Both Sea Spice and Modern Garden offer a great setting for private and corporate events. And not to mention, Sunday fun days are a must. Get ready to dance the day away and be showered by our champagne brunch. Mingle and die amongst the sexiest crowd in Miami. Being Italian, there's a few words I like to use, and one is punto, or point. And the point is, there's no better place to get Italian food than at Puntino. All of their dishes are prepared by their renowned culinary maestro, Chef Fabio Vaccarella, from the freshest seafood and homemade pastas, or farm fresh meats. If you're still hungry after that for some more mouth-watering food, then take a walk next door to their pizzeria. Puntino's pizza is the real deal. Get to the point and have a taste of Puntino's. Wolfgang's Steakhouse welcomes you to Miami. After four decades of experience as head waiter at Peter Luger's Steakhouse, it is fair to say that Wolfgang's wiener learned his craft well. Wolfgang has four restaurants in New York City, one in Beverly Hills, another in Waikiki, Hawaii, and now in Miami. Oh, I'm happy to be here in Miami to bring you the best steaks what money can buy. It is dry, aged, prime beef, very juicy and delicious, and I'm very proud of it. The ambiance is straight up classic steakhouse with shiny hardwood floors, a fully stocked mahogany bar, a high-end wine cellar, crisp white table linens, and no-nonsense service. Get a seat near the front, and your view of the Miami River will entertain all night. 
tuck yourself away in the back of the house for a lower profile experience or reserve one of the three private rooms for your special gathering. It's easy to know what to order here. After all, the signature food is written into the restaurant's title. Perfect marbling makes this steak a juicy, tender offering and Wolfgang's prepares it with the utmost care. Selecting a side dish for this exceptional cut of meat is easy. Go with something green. Creamed spinach or sautéed broccoli would have done the trick, but the asparagus is particularly eye-catching. Of course, the porterhouse for two, three, four, or more is recommended. Zwiener takes great pride in his porterhouse. He uses only USDA prime meat, all from the Midwest, and aged on premise under specific temperature and humidity controls. In addition to steak, one can choose from a simple but scrumptious array of seafood, including jumbo lobster, grilled yellowfin tuna, wild salmon, or Chilean sea bass. For a starter course, may we suggest the out-of-this-world crab cake, little neck clams on the half shell, oysters, lobster cocktail, and jumbo shrimp cocktail. If one wants to indulge in dessert, one can choose from a decadent Junior's New York style cheesecake, apple strudel, homemade key lime pie, as well as the ice cream sundae, which is a throwback to old ice cream parlor offerings served in a soda shop style glass. All desserts are served with the homemade schlag, or whipped cream. The bottom line here is the quality of the steaks. Top-notch cuts that attract a slew of repeat customers. It's no wonder the place is so good. Ultimately, Wolfgang Steakhouse is a classic, high-quality American steakhouse. Located in downtown Miami at 315 South Biscayne Boulevard or call 305-487-7130. I look forward to see you in the restaurant and to enjoy your juicy best steak you will ever have in your life. Yukaku Japanese Barbecue is now in the heart of Brickell. With over 700 locations worldwide, Yukaku is known for its fresh ingredients, featuring various types of meats like Kobe's style ribeye, toro beef, premium kalbi, fresh vegetables and mushrooms, and a great line of desserts and drinks. Now you can enjoy this amazing concept and become your own grill master. Being able to cook fresh meats and other foods yourself makes this Yakiniku restaurant so much fun. The food tastes incredible when you prepare it yourself, just the way you like. It's a place where couples and families go and enjoy with happy conversation. Yukaku is always filled with smiles as everyone is amazed with its friendly atmosphere. People around the world love Yukaku. Visit us in the heart of Brickell at 34 Southwest 13th Street. Call 305-400-8915 to reserve your grill station or log on to www.yukaku.com for additional information and specials. How are you today? My name is Michael, and this is Philly Stone Crab Restaurant and Marketplace. I'm going to take you on a tour of the restaurant and show you around, right this way. Okay, I'm going to show you over to our outdoor dining, where we have our gliders and our dock seating. This is our outdoor dining, where you can enjoy lunch and dinner from our glides or our private dock, seven days a week, 12 o'clock to 10 o'clock every day. We also do private parties out here. We have our glides where we can do a private party, or we have our dock which seats 30 people for a private function. Welcome to our marketplace. Let me show you around. We have the stone crabs with our signature world famous mustard sauce that comes with the stone crabs in all sizes, from mediums to the selects, large, jumbo, and colossal. You're always able to order the crabs right over here, sit down in our marketplace, have our market manager, Rich, take care of you, all your needs, Get your crabs from Rich, sit down and enjoy your meal in here. Any gathering you might have, corporate events, parties. We call this our wine room. This is where we store all our wines. We have over 100 different labels of bottles of wine and champagne. Hi, now I'm gonna take you up to our second floor, up to our dining room and lounge area. 
And this is our main dining room on the second floor. We have floor to ceiling windows in this room, a beautiful bar with our bartenders Nadine and Diane. This room seats up to 120 people. We also do functions in here. We have a beautiful sunset from the second floor. And let me introduce you to my head waiter, Michael. He'll give you a little display on what we have here. Here we're known for our fresh Florida stone crabs. They're served cold, they're cracked in the kitchen, served with our world famous mustard sauce on the side. All different sizes we offer here this afternoon. We have our mediums, medium select, large, jumbo, and of course the prized colossal stone crab claw. Folks, we're looking forward to see you sometime. And again, welcome to Billy Stone Crab. an adventure? Then what are you waiting for? Next stop is at Jungle Island, home to the world's rarest and most fascinating animals. Located in the heart of Miami, just minutes from the hustle and bustle of South Beach, Jungle Island offers guests up close and personal interactions with red kangaroos, royal white tigers, lemurs, and more. Marvel at engaging animal shows and presentations and go behind the scenes during an exclusive VIP safari tour. You'll get up close and personal with some of the world's rarest and most fascinating animals. It's unlike anything you've ever experienced before. During this privately guided 90-minute tour, interact with everything from red ruffed lemurs, the only tame cassowary on the planet, red kangaroos from Australia, to Aldabra tortoises and spectacular parrots. Also, monkey around with orangutans and even hold a baby tiger. One thing is for sure, this behind the scenes experience will captivate you in ways you never thought imaginable. On hot days, cool off under palm fronds that naturally shade parts of the park and Parrot Cove, Jungle Island's private beach. Parrot Cove is home to a thrilling new aqua park that floats on Biscayne Bay. Nestled on Watson Island in the heart of Miami, Jungle Island offers a number of VIP safari tour packages, easily customizable to each guest preference. Ask your hotel concierge for help arranging this unforgettable experience. Is your game ready for Crandon? Experience Crandon Golf at Key Biscayne. Open to the public year-round. Visit Country Club of Miami. For tea times, visit GolfMiamiDade.com or call 1-855-GOLF-305. Hi, welcome to Crowning Golf Course. My name is Santos Caceres and I'm the assistant golf professional here at the beautiful Key Biscayne, Florida. I'd like to give you some tips uh, regarding golf and when to play and how to play it. Uh, many times I find golfers on the phone asking me questions about the weather. You know, we get curtains of rain that don't last too long. But what I'm going to tell you is that after those 15, 20 minutes are passed, it's a great time to play golf. Temperature goes down and uh, yeah, and you can enjoy the weather. My next tip will be to watch out for lightning. Lightning, it is very dangerous here in South Florida, so you need to be careful with that. Uh, in the summer, look out for 2, 2 p.m., 3 p.m. That's where really uh, lightning strikes the most and the, and the hardest. My advice to you is to walk inside the clubhouse 
seek shelter, wait for the storm to pass by, and then go out and give it a shot again. And my final tip to you uh, today here would be be prepared. Bring sunblock, be prepared for mosquitoes, bug repellent, and drink plenty, plenty of water. You need to stay hydrated and you need to watch out for those moments of the day where it's really, really hot and make sure you get enough fluids in your body so you can have fun and have a great day. Country Club of Miami and the golf courses of Miami-Dade County Parks. For tee times, visit GolfMiamiDade.com or call 1-855-GOLF-305. Crandon Golf at Key Biscayne and the golf courses of Miami-Dade County Parks. For tee times, visit GolfMiamiDade.com or call 1-855-GOLF-305. No visit to Miami is complete without a splashtacular day at the city's favorite attraction. Miami Seaquarium is all about getting closer to the ocean and the amazing creatures that call it home. All ages will enjoy high-flying shows starring TV's Flipper and his dolphin friends. Miami Seaquarium's own comedian, Salty the Sea Lion, will have you in hysterics. And of course, you can't miss Miami's biggest superstar, Lolita the Killer Whale. Sit up close for a two-ton super splash that's sure to cool you off. You can even pet a stingray, meet endangered manatees and sea turtles, and so much more. If you want to get even closer, try one of Miami Seaquarium's amazing animal interactions. At Dolphin Harbor, you can choose a deep water dolphin odyssey complete with a dorsal pull, or a shallow water dolphin encounter that requires no swimming at all and is perfect for kids as young as five. A Miami Seaquarium seal swim is your chance to share the water with some of the ocean's friendliest and most curious characters. And the amazing Sea Trek Reef Encounter is an underwater tour through the park's incredible reef tank. You'll wear a space age diving helmet that makes it as easy to breathe underwater as it is up top. Welcome to Miami Seaquarium, South Florida's favorite attraction. You won't want to miss our high flying shows and amazing exhibits. Visit us 365 days a year, rain or shine. Talk to your concierge or visit MiamiSeaquarium.com for special offers and more information. I can't wait to see you at the park. Great shows, amazing exhibits, and unforgettable experiences. They're all part of your day at Miami's favorite attraction, Miami Seaquarium, located minutes from downtown on Key Biscayne, just off the Rickenbacker Causeway. Visiting Resorts World Bimini is now more exciting than ever. Experience the exclusive adventure of a seaplane flying directly from Miami or Fort Lauderdale. Visit rwbimini.com to book your seaplane to Resorts World Bimini today. The star-studded Food Network and Cooking Channel South Beach Wine and Food Festival, presented by Food and Wine, returns February 24th through the 28th, 2016. This year celebrating its 15th anniversary. Known as America's favorite culinary extravaganza, the festival showcases the talents of the world's most renowned wine and spirits producers, chefs, and culinary personalities. Hosted by Southern Wine and Spirits of Florida and Florida International University, FIU, the festival has raised more than $22 million for Florida International University's Chaplin School of Hospitality and Tourism Management and the Southern Wine and Spirits Beverage Management Center. Here's a taste of what to expect in 2016. More than 90 events over five days. 200 renowned chefs, culinary personalities, and all of your favorite Food Network and Cooking Channel stars. More than 150 wineries and spirits producers representing the Southern Wine and Spirits of Florida portfolio. Tickets go on sale in October 2015.
Explore and discover the many things to do in Miami-Dade County by riding Miami-Dade Transit. From Miami International Airport, you can hop on Metro Rail with 23 stations serving major destinations throughout the county. Metro Rail operates seven days a week from 5 a.m. to 12 a.m. Scores of Metro bus routes crisscross most of Miami-Dade, connecting with free trolley services offered by local municipalities. The options don't stop after you settle into your hotel. All of downtown Miami is close by with Metro Mover, our free people mover system. Plan your visit to nearby shops, restaurants, and entertainment in the downtown Brickell area using Metro Mover. Everybody rides free. Download our app, MDT Tracker, to plan your next adventure around Miami-Dade County. Welcome to Coral Gables, the city beautiful, located in the heart of Miami, yet worlds apart. A dream materialized by visionary entrepreneur George Merrick in 1925 is today celebrated as an international city with numerous consulates, multinational corporations, as well as the world-class University of Miami. From historic cottages to waterway and golf club estates, Coral Gables offers a wide variety of housing options. Getting to and around the city of Coral Gables is a breeze. It's less than five miles from Miami International Airport and minutes from Port Miami. Hop on one of the city's free vintage trolleys that serve the downtown on weekdays and connect up with Miami Metro Rail, making it easy to discover the city beautiful. Living in style in Coral Gables is easy. Fine dining, outdoor cafes, chic shopping, bridal boutiques, and one-of-a-kind retailers, all in a walkable, tree-lined downtown district. Downtown Coral Gables is anchored by its main street, Miracle Mile, an ideal shop and stroll boulevard offering truly personal service and one-of-a-kind products. When all that shopping has you thirsty and hungry for local flavors, rest assured that dozens of excellent restaurants and cafes are waiting to serve you. Check out shopcoralgables.com for a selection of great places to dine. South of downtown in Miracle Mile, fashion and style come to life in the outdoor shopping center, the village of Merrick Park. Anchored by Neiman Marcus and Nordstrom, Merritt Park offers luxury retailers such as Tiffany's and others, surrounded by fountains and tropical foliage. History is front and center in the city beautiful. Travel the banyan-lined streets of Coral Gables. Visit the founder's childhood home, much like it was in the 1920s. Pass by the majestic DeSoto Fountain through Mediterranean entrances, all reminiscent of a faraway European city off in the spring-fed Venetian pool, inspired by the lagoons of Venice and surrounded by Spanish-style buildings. Recognized as one of the world's coolest pools, it attracts visitors from around the world. Arts and culture are alive in the city of Coral Gables. The Coral Gables Museum is the cultural hub of the city beautiful and is located in the original police and fire station, a historic 1939 coral stone building and WPA project. The museum's focus is architecture, urban design and planning, sustainable development, and preservation. It's one of the few regional historic buildings certified by the U.S. Green Building Council, and its galleries, meeting rooms, and exterior event spaces are always buzzing with activity. Learn about the history, architecture, and environmental heritage of South Florida. Visitors enjoy exhibits, lectures, wine tastings, artisan food fests, concerts, and movies on the plaza. See CoralGablesMuseum.org for all museum information and events. Literary enthusiasts will enjoy the sanctuary of Books and Books, celebrated as one of North America's best independent bookstores. Live theater or art cinema? It's your choice, as the city boasts several theaters. Locals and visitors alike enjoy a variety of fine art galleries. Patrons can ride the city's trolley until 10 p.m. to partake in Gallery Night, the first Friday of each month. Coral Gables offers plenty of recreational pursuits set against a lush tropical background. 40 miles of waterways weave throughout the Miami Riviera and make their way inland from Biscayne Bay through exclusive neighborhoods. 
get active at one of the city's golf courses or tennis courts, including the Biltmore's Championship Golf Course, designed by Donald Ross in 1925. Stop by Fairchild Tropical Botanic Garden, an 83-acre botanic garden with extensive collections of rare tropical plants for an enchanting stroll along the paths surrounded by the wonders and beauty of nature. View impressive art and mingle with butterflies and birds. Or kick back at Matheson Hammock Park and Marina, a haven to enjoy warm waters and beautiful views. The park has a full-service marina as well as a gourmet waterfront restaurant. Something for everyone, offered in an enchanting, tranquil and tropical setting like no other. That's Coral Gables. Discover your oasis and visit www.coralgables.com. Since 1968, Bellotto Clothiers has set the standard for quality men's apparel. Founded by Jose Bellotto Sr., Bellotto Clothiers represents high-end, stylish brands that will take you from work to play and everywhere in between. Hi, I'm Jose Bolado with uh, Bolado Clothiers here in Coral Gables. Uh, we would like to welcome you to Coral Gables. It's a beautiful city that we've been uh, established since 1968. Get the best in timeless fashion, as you will find a selection of name brands such as Copley, Palzileri, Jack Victor, Southern Tide, and their exclusive Guayaberas. Uh, one of the things that we specialize is our custom shirt department, our uh, custom clothing department. We, can, we have a pretty quick turnaround. It's something that uh, we can cater, again, to all sizes, all tastes, and all wants. Our store hours are from, not, from 10 o'clock to 7 o'clock weekdays, and Saturdays are from 10 o'clock to 6 o'clock. We are closed Sundays, uh, however, we can make special appointments. All you have to do is either call our number or email. After 47 years in business, Bellotto Clothier still remains in its permanent Coral Gables location at 314 Miracle Mile. For more information, visit www.bellottoclothiers.com or call 305-448-2507. Miami and the Beaches has several of the country's most sought after events that attract visitors from all over the country and the world. Next, Miami International Boat Show, now in a new location at Marine Stadium, Virginia Key, February 11th through the 15th, 2016. Considered the world's leading boat show, with all of the top luxury yachting brands converging on the marinas and waterways. Up next is the culinary gem that is the South Beach Food and Wine, a week-long festival now in its 15th year and sure to be enjoyed by countless visitors during the week of February 24th through the 28th. The star-studded Food Network and Cooking Channel South Beach Wine and Food Festival, presented by Food and Wine, returns February 24th through the 28th, 2016, this year celebrating its 15th anniversary. Known as America's favorite culinary extravaganza, the festival showcases the talents of the world's most renowned wine and spirits producers, chefs, and culinary personalities. Hosted by Southern Wine and Spirits of Florida and Florida International University, FIU, the festival has raised more than $22 million for Florida International University's Chaplin School of Hospitality and Tourism Management and the Southern Wine and Spirits Beverage Management Center. Here's a taste of what to expect in 2016. More than 90 events over five days. 200 renowned chefs, culinary personalities, and all of your favorite Food Network and Cooking Channel stars. More than 150 wineries and spirits producers representing the Southern Wine and Spirits of Florida portfolio. Tickets go on sale in October 2015. Need a lift to and from the airport? One click or phone call to Super Shuttle can take you from your home, hotel, or office to and from MIA hassle-free. Super Shuttle is your affordable, convenient, reliable, and comfortable 24-hour solution to the airport. 
Our spacious vans and execu cars can accommodate large groups, families, or individual riders, and our friendly drivers are equipped with the latest touchscreen technology. Give us a call or go to supershuttle.com and book your reservation today. Make every trip a super trip with Super Shuttle. Visiting Resorts World Bimini is now more exciting than ever. Experience the exclusive adventure of a seaplane flying directly from Miami or Fort Lauderdale. Visit rwbimini.com to book your seaplane to Resorts World Bimini today.